Welcome back everyone, Drake Hawkins with you again, and I'm joined of course by Kitch for some more continuation of our multiplayer series. Uh, what, well, last time when we ended, we were like, watching biters attack us. Apparently they, they didn't survive the attack, so. Before we get started, if you're enjoying the series, please hit that like button, it helps me out, and if you haven't already joined the clan, hit the subscribe button, and stay tuned for more great content. Where are the speed controls on these miners? Um, they're right <laughs> down here. These smoky things that are... Oh, another belt was destroyed. Or another belt ah. was destroyed. Oh, that's probably what the power shortage is. Ah, and here I was really? down here building extra steam engines. No, I'm sorry, but uh, this is just not okay. I now have <laughs> an odd number of underground belts and an odd number of underground pipes. <laughs> it's just driving me crazy. Well, I mean, it, it makes a little bit more sense in a death world now that I'm thinking about it, right? Because because things get eaten. Because things it get eaten. Happens. Mm-hmm. It just happens. And okay, yeah. Oh, okay. Is that okay? That help? Yeah. There we go. And uh, I can. I have a place to put my other two. And we'll just, uh, you know, if you're going to double power, you might as well triple it, right? That's right. Go big or go home. There we go. <clears throat> I like it. Oh, look at that. Look at that beautifully placed uh, wooden chest there. <laughs> Who'd have thunk it, huh? You go in there. You, we don't need. Don't need those. Don't need that. All right, I'm going to go check on the wall situation up here. I think I might have over-furnished, um, producing a little little less stone than we can actually uh, do. We are going to need to look into that stone. Where is, that stone's actually reasonably close and somewhat safe, question mark. Uh, Tech-wise, we definitely need to go Military 2 next, I think. Two above right, we, then Military 2. We are... Very close to getting the power poles we need in order to get the steel not looking like a a mess. Mm-hmm. Right, like, now-ish. Come on, guys. There we go. All right. I'll get to work on that. Circuits and belts. Uh, I think we're... I'm going to make a chest for uh, green circuits. It's just going to have, like, in them. A thousand green circuits eventually in it. So we have a bit of a, a stockpile. Um, gears, what do we got there? A couple hundred. So you don't be right there and there. And we can get rid of this big pile of nonsense here. That's good on this side. Uh, what's your problem? Oh, you are missing long handed inserters. Oh, you weren't talking to me. <laughs> All right, and this is. If you to... have many, yeah, you got a box of them up here, don't you? Of them? What are them? Uh, inserters. Yep. Just borrow a couple of those. I need some need some red ones to finish this out. And do I have some of these? I have some of those. This is like the greatest si planned out science production ever. You're going to be amazed. You were amazed at yesterday's amazing <laughs> performance of the South Spaghetti Central. You're going to be awed and inspired. That's right. Entirely inspired. Your next series is going to be entirely about how to make things even uglier than Drake does. I'm feeling like you're not following it's me on this side. It's it's actually it's actually kind of feeling good. I'm I'm actually kind of liking it. I'm usually very very uh, a little a little bit too obsessively organized with things, and I'm I'm feeling good. <laughs> it, it feels freeing. It's refreshing. Right? I'm having fun. <laughs> it is fun. This is a lot of fun. Um, I don't know if it's particularly fun to watch, but I guess I'll find it. <laughs> I know I got a, a couple of my watchers right now that, that probably have these big red spots on their forehead from them slapping. <laughs> no, don't don't let them do that. No, no, no. 
Oh, I doubled up those power poles and totally did not need to do that. This is this is why you have blueprints, kid, so you don't make those mistakes. What is this blueprints thing you speak of? I do not understand. Oh yeah, and I could I could I could put a belt right there and we could actually get stuff going on this side too. Look, we doubled our science. I'm so fast at this. Except for we didn't double our science. Why are you, why are you guys no. not, Oh, we didn't double our science because we're not actually requesting them to, like, do science. What? Oh. <laughs> there we go. Now they're active. Look at that. Yeah. <clears throat> that was one of the you know the default option not having the uh not having the science pop up it's mm -hmm. kind of a a very bittersweet thing for me i i absolutely hated the science pop-up pausing the game mm -hmm. but uh I, I often find myself in the situation where i'm not researching anything because i forgot to do it uh yeah quite frequently myself as well I just uh, there's a mod called uh, auto research or something like that that just goes ahead and automatically does the uh, the, the lowest research item on the totem pole, oh, and uh, or or at least a way to queue that up is something I I've seen that one yeah where you can queue things up, that's good stuff to me. Uh, Boy, I've got so much stone in my inventory. Oh, I guess it was because I just completely resigned all that. Okay. Oh, Where's peninsula. Where's steel going to come out? There. Copper steel plates. <clears throat> um. Is this going to be a steel line? Is that what this is? Do I not Are we going to have a steel line through, like, to the east here, like this? Is that what this is for? Am I doing this right? Um, yeah. That's yeah, that'll work the there. Best piece of something. I mean, we're gonna really probably just replace this entire darn thing, right? I mean. Yeah, yeah. Generally, I set up my buses where I have two little extra spaces over here, and I run a walkway down one of them. And this one over here, I do for the stuff like roboports and uh, fluid buses, things like that that you can collide with. Right. Um, so it keeps the bus open, so you can like run a car down it. It's uh, extremely handy. That is quite nice. That would have been useful in pretty much every game that I've played. <clears throat> right. But what is also nice is making things <laughs> and getting the stuff out there before the uh, before they kill us all. Alright, we've got a full steel column going right now, except for the inserters that I forgot. Alright, now it's all going. Because I'm stealing it now. Thanks, bye-bye. <laughs> I'm just piping it down south so we can uh, start Militarying it up. Uh, we're gonna need two of these. I think provides five. Three percent. It's is it one. is it one to three two, two one. ratio on those? It's three to or one. Uh, three to three one. Three seconds for well, if you're doing trying to do time wise, it's three seconds for uh, piercing, and it's one. And second three seconds for that. For that. Okay, so one of those for this, and three seconds for piercing. So. So we can basically produce three uh, run. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to change things up here a little bit. Oh, I forget I have I have the good power poles now. Um, you can be that, please. And then you're going to do what? How do I... How do I output these? I can do... And where did they go? Right there. Uh, uh, whoops. Yeah. To... Arg. Can't reach. <clears throat> um, hmm. I was trying to actually just... Shove these in, but I'll, I'll move it. Oh no, I killed the power again. Here. Have an alternative power because I keep knocking out the power. <laughs> like over and over and knocking the power down. Uh, do this. Uh, that. Go over here. 
I mean, it is really just simple, Drake. You could just have it run normally. Be a normal person. That would be. Hey, walls! I forgot about those. Oh, and looks like they're looks like they're needed down here. What? What? All right, these guys do the piercy thing. What do we need for it? Copper and steel. This is a little too tight. <clears throat> Um, I can do the regular ammo here. Um, yeah, I need to definitely get uh, definitely get some of this bar set up so I know where things are. Output there. There we go. A little, little compact in here. <laughs> I'm literally trying to do another silly, amusing thing, and it's not working. It's just not working. Oh well, we'll do it this way. I've been in like a spaghetti build mode lately, where I'm actually <laughs> more interested in the can I make this work in a way that it should not work scenario rather than thinking about like a sensible way to do things which is probably a annoying to watch and b <laughs> probably really stupid okay so just take you in there and uh right there change up and... the belt here we got all these new things you go out. You go out to a box. Ah, okay. There's regular belt and undergrounds. Um, you guys, I guess you require a blue assembler. Is that correct? Probably makes sense. Probably all those should be blue. Yeah, we should definitely have. All right, this isn't working for me. And, oh, you require circuits. Hmm. Hmm. Work like this actually. Oh yeah, this is totally gonna work. You'll be awed and amazed at how ridiculously tightly this fits. <clears throat> Not that that's a good thing. It's just ludicrous, but it'll work. Oh bother. That's a, that's a bad thing, right? Yep, building was destroyed. It were broked. Okay, and you guys can output it like this. Oh no! is you that'll do that don't have enough room for this and what else do you need you do need iron as well Oh, so I can get you both. I can. I probably couldn't have used more resources to make this work, but <clears throat> I don't think it's possible. I think this is the most inefficient design I could have come up with. Unless being really compact and small is counts as efficient, but... No, this looks great. No, this looks Check great. This out. Where do they go? <laughs> Right there. Oh, okay, they're on the outside. Gotcha, gotcha. I see him there. Yay. 
Not sure. Oh, why so that's why the old on that side. It really needed to work that way. Yeah. You know, no, no, no. no. Much that was racking my brain. It works though. That works. We've got red ammo now. Yep. And we uh, we've got a ton of turrets. And a uh, ton of turrets. And uh, how is the wall situation up here doing? I'm going to guess not swimmingly. We don't want our walls swimming. That would be very bad. Yeah, actually, we're filling up three of these furnaces, which uh, nice. is more than I was expecting. Very nice. Uh... And we have a lot of damaged walls. Which is better than damaged turrets. It is. Look at that. We've got splitters. I gotta, I gotta get you to come over and hang out on my episodes. <laughs> on my channel. That way I'll have resources. <laughs> it's working though. This is working. <clears throat> this looks very um KOS ish. Just Yes. It's a beautiful. Yes, thing. it is. The my the, the mall mall blueprint that I use is was basically hers. Nice. Uh for, from a long time ago. I she uh since I since she did that original mall blueprint, it was a, like a long time ago, like maybe over a year ago or something like that. Yeah, I remember. That. Um last time I saw her put down a mall, it was like three times the size and and and, and made literally everything in the factory. I I, I haven't it, kept yeah. up with that. And it had like uh filter or not filters, um like the upgrades, whatever the heck they're and my my, my brain's blanking. Modules. It was like four yeah. modules. Like modules. modules blueprint. Yeah. yeah. Speaking of blueprints, how about we actually learn some things? Uh but for one of my for well, for my blueprint series, one of the things I'm working on is making one that's a little bit more more module. Because the one thing I don't like about that mall blueprint is that you place it down whenever you're like at this phase, right? Mm -hmm. And you can't make everything. And I never can remember what all the things are. <laughs> yes. And so you have all these blank spaces, and and you need to and you need other things. So you start filling them in with other things. And uh, we've got. Um, do you have any? Oh, I've got plenty of ammo. I don't know what I'm talking about. I do also have ammo. I have more ammo than I should. Apparently, I picked up a pistol somewhere. Have I died? No, I haven't died. Why do I have a pistol? You moved the uh, trash box, didn't you? I moved it like 10 feet, I think, yeah. Where did it go? It's out by the coal. Speaking of which, do we have enough power to do all this nonsense? Ooh, barely. Um, we make 9.2 megawatts, and we're using 8 to 9.3. I'm not sure how we're getting yeah, it's to 9 fine. but it's perfectly <laughs> fine. These steam engines are just cranking out as much as they can possibly do. It's fantastic. Go away, bad pistol guy. I don't want you. Okay. What I think I, we should do is uh, put in a cut here and then make next episode our first uh, Take the Fight to the Biters. Take the Fight to the Biters episode? Yeah, I'm going to actually... Go and... Uh... I'm going to make this uh, chest fill up some piercing ammunition for us. Can we grab some uranium so I can like make uranium ammunition next? Because that stuff's amazing. <laughs> that is a very noticeable difference when you get oh, that. Gosh, yeah. it's um, uh, a, a, a tank with uh, uranium ammo and you really, you know, get, it's, it's pretty much game over. Mm-hmm. I uh, just did that in my season two Death World. At like eighty episodes in, and I'm and I just finally went back and thought, hey, I should use uh, get some uranium ammo going. I think I told you about mine. I I overproduced it by I think I had like maybe forty factories making uranium ammo, and uh, then converted everything over to lasers and never touched it again. <laughs> Look what I got for you. Yay! Better suit of armor. Oh, are we are we moving on up? Moving on up? Mm-hmm. All now, right. What now is? Now look at me. This... Oh, I look exactly the same. Look exactly the same. Okay, I guess it's not till the modular armor where you look like <laughs> a uh, like somebody from Fallout. <laughs> yes. Yeah, indeed. You get you get all nasty crazy. I actually also just recently got my uh, full upgrade to the armor two in that series, so the power armor two. Oh yeah, the, the power armor two is something I definitely rushed to. 
Yeah. You can, you can fit more Robo ports in it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I've got a couple of those, like three sets of leg armor. I keep running into things because I get to the edge of the screen before I realize it. It's great fun. But uh, we're looking at uh, a flashy timer here, so we could probably uh, get ourselves on out of here. Alrighty. Uh, this is you, right? No, this is you. I intro Didn't I? You did. I did. Okay, I I well, did. I can outro. Sure. Well, thank you all very much for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, if you like the video, if you want to go ahead and hit that like button down below, we would really appreciate it. Helps uh, both channels out a lot. Uh, go check out Drake's channel. And thank you very much for watching. We will see you next time.